Clear Rich Radio is the voice of DJ Scream on your airways. Moran is here. We got a special guest in the building representing that St. Pete, Florida. Let's give Word. it up for Project Younger on Hood Rich Radio. What's up? What's up, bro? How you feeling? How you feeling? Yo, what's up? I'm good. You know I'm blessed to be here. Welcome to the ATL, man. I talk to us. Uh, you on this tripolar tour? Talk to us about how it's been going for you. Yeah, it's been going good. You know, every every city we we showing up, rocking out. You know. Okay. Mm. Now, no. the, now the magic question we ask people who who've been on tour or are on tour is: Have you had a chance in the luxury of crowd surfing yet? Nah, I ain't. Crowd no crowd surfing, surfing nah. man. You don't trust your fans. Nah, I ain't. It you ain't, don't trust your fans. Nah, I don't. I love my fans, my fans, you know. But I'm on her tour. Not that I don't trust her fans. But, okay. Mm. You know, you you got one out of every hundred or thousand that's going. You know, they want to. What's the word I'm looking for? Drop you. No, nah, they want to go go viral. Okay, like, clown chase. Have a moment. Clown yeah. chase, yeah. I, got, I, I ain't tucking none of my chains. I'm wearing all my jewelry every show. There you mm-hmm. go. So it's safe to say when you have your own tour, you'll do some crowd surfing. Yeah, I, I, try, I try to jump out there. What's with some of the pros and cons of this tour so far? Uh, you know, just getting out. You know, new cities, um, reaching new fans, New, you know, more of the pros. Ain't had too many cons, you know. We just, we go up the flow, you know, we run away, so. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, how's Absolutely. it feel to be uh representing for Florida? Um, oh, it feel good. Me, I'm just, I'm just doing me, you know, mm-hmm. doing my thing, you know, putting on. I'm just glad I'm in a position to be putting on for Florida, you know. Right. You mentioned Florida, you gotta mention Project Young. Like mm-hmm. we working, you know. That's a lot. We ain't content. We ain't where we want to be, but I ain't where I was when I first started, you know. Mm-hmm. I y'all, I y'all like right, like right there with Tampa, right? It's like yeah, we like right over the bridge. Like, like okay, so y'all feel like maybe sometimes Tampa. Like, y'all artists get kind of overshadowed by what's going on there? No. No? Not at all? <laughs> ain't nobody ever made it from where we from. Okay. You know, so it ain't no, we can't, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna say the artists get get overshadowed by that, but you know, a lot of people ain't heard of St. Petersburg. Mm. We gotta tell them, oh, we right by Tampa. Mm. I'm quick to tell them, I ain't from Tampa, I'm from St. Pete. Mm. Mm. Absolutely. What's, what, what's, some of the artists, what's some of the artists down there that uh, we should be aware of? Uh, uh, maybe some people in your crew or something like that. Rod Wave, um, OTM Frenchie, no so. Yeah, that's that's about it. Mm. Have you had a chance to get any work in with like some of the Atlanta artists? Yeah, I got okay. songs with Baby. I got songs with Rollo, Free Rollo. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, that's my brother right there. I still I talk to him every other day. Okay. Um, who else? Marlo. Mm. All right, Marlo and Baby Heavy. Okay. What's some of the goals for Project Youngin? Because obviously, you know, you're in the game. There's a lot of rappers, right? But what's going to separate you from everybody else? And what's your goals? I mean, what's going to separate me from them is like, when you see me, you, you what you see is what you get. You know, like, of course, everybody, I'm in it for the money. Everybody want to, you know, everybody got their own reasons. I just want to make sure I'm in a position to make sure my family's straight. You know, like, mm. when I when I, when I I rap, you hear my music, you going to... I got that that pain music, like that heartfelt, you know, like mm-hmm. really painting vivid pictures. Like when I when when you listen to me, you you gonna see like man, like you know, you gonna see what I'm rapping about clearly. Mm-hmm. What are some things that you've been through on a personal level? You know a lot, like group home from group home, mm-hmm. homeless being um, my whole senior high school. You know, like I'm going home from home, staying with my friends and they mama. Today mama put me out, then going to the next. House, you know, that really like opened my eyes, let me know. Like, I really told myself, like, you know, after getting put out so many times, like, I ain't gonna never need nobody for shit. You feel me? Mm. Wow, well, group home to a Rolex, yeah, right, bro? yeah, yeah, group home to a Rolex. Sound like a mixtape, hey. yeah. I had a, my last, <laughs> I, my, my last project was group home living, group home living, yeah, they yeah, real good, yeah. So, what type of stuff you into when you're not doing the music? Mm. I like player. I like it on them jet skis, you know. Oh, I'm you a on <laughs> yeah, I don't really play 2K. Yeah. I, I do it, but I just be on that that Fortnite keep me out of trouble too. Yeah, I ain't gonna mm. lie, but Fortnite jet skis. I, I just if I ain't in, the, well, I ain't gonna say that because I really like I like getting locked in the studio and recording. Like, mm. That's that's me. I know that the the be the best, you gotta beat the best, and mm. them people working, so you gotta mm. keep up. Mm. Yeah, man. So we're having like a deal and everything, tour and everything. Like the women, I ain't got no deal. You ain't got no deal. I'm still independent. independent. Yeah. Okay, be clear. He's uh, independent. Two hundred thousand up in jury. I ain't got no deal. Uh, them trophies. Be clear. Cut us off. Real he quick. ain't looking for one. Let's <laughs> nah. the math right. Now I ain't gonna lie. Uh, shout out to Sony Orchid. They um, I did a uh, 
a one project, a one okay. one one project deal, one album deal. Gotcha. But yeah, other I ain't got no deal. I'm independent. So mm. independent, but being successful in touring and, and and such. Do the women act a lot different with you now? Is it weird? Yeah. Is it weird in your DMs? Is it weird outside your DMs? Is yeah, it weird? You know, I felt when God had said go down in the DM, I felt that. <laughs> Maybe a couple of years ago it went over my head, but right. now, now, <laughs> now, now I feel that. So how how do you how do you deal how do you deal with that? Like if it's if 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 it's a female giving you love and you know it's fake love, but you might think she attractive. How you deal with it? I might think she attractive, but I, but I you know, know it's fake, fake love. love. Mm. She wanna try to holler at me two years ago. Right. Uh, I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to tell it one time and cut off. I ain't okay, gonna talk you gonna to tell up. Tear Yo, up. Tell New up lingo time. alert. All right. Tell up. I can cut some here. I mean, it's Hillary's <laughs> Radio, man. What the fuck you talking about, now. man? It's hey, Hillary's Radio. Fuck you. Hey, shot DJ Screen. I'm in here. Yeah, I'm with the real Hillary. Oh, yeah, Florida in the building. Yeah. Florida boy, we running this here this year. Word. So you gonna tell? Yeah, I'm gonna tell and stop. Yeah, I ain't got time. But like, you gonna let her know though. This is not we believe in keeping it solid. But you gonna let her know that's what it is. You ain't gonna tell her you finna love her. And no, all that. I'm gonna not gonna know. tell her that or tell her that. She gonna like you said. She coming at me. Fake. So if you coming at me, you want something. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like everybody ain't genuine like that, you know. But if you run across them genuine, like you could tell, like you said, you could tell. Now let me let you sent me a DM and I sent. I see I sent you one. 12 months ago. Right. No reply. No reply. Yeah. Like, it's a little different yeah. than you just meeting somebody and, you know, because I ain't going to put that on all females because all of them ain't the same. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Just like all us. All us niggas ain't the same. Mm. No, it's still some good ones left. Right, right, right. You know I mean? So So that same thing can apply to, like, you know, the rap game and, you know, doing music and yeah. features and all and that. And we get, and I get that, and I done seen that, like, shout out to Rollo, shout out to Baby, mm. shout out to Key Glock, like, I mm. got videos and features with them. I ain't paid them a dime. Mm. Like, you know, it's genuine. Like, But then you get these rappers that you probably done reached out to a couple mm. years ago. And then now, like, you you on the, they see your, your little bubble going and your, your wave riding. And now mm. it's like a little different. Mm. Feel me? So it is. It's rap game the same as the dope game and all, all the same. Like, I treat it the same. Mm. Who's some of the people that curved you? In the what? The rap, rap game? Yeah. As in, like anybody who you reached out to trying to work, and now they trying to come back around. I ain't, I can't really say they curved me, you mm-hmm. know, but it done been something that been like, oh, I need, oh, what name? Features this, like, I need this amount. Mm-hmm. I need two thousand. Like, I ain't gonna say they curved. Like, I'm gonna give y'all this for an example. When I first started, we reached out. Uh, I don't know if you heard of like Tom G. He was out in yeah. Tampa. Shout out to Tom G. Yeah, shout out to Tom G. When we reached out to him, mm-hmm. me and my brother, Free Chauncey, by the way, me and my brother, like, we going to have on everything investing in ourselves. Mm-hmm. Like, we had to pay him. We paid him. And I think it was like 3000 for for then, like, 1500 for the video type stuff. Mm-hmm. Boom. Two years later, now, my way jumping. Oh, I need a feature for my little brother. All right, cool. I just want my money back that I gave you. It's fair. Right. It's fair. Right. That's all I want. Fair. I ain't going to, you feel me? I rock mm-hmm. with you. woo mm-hmm. Mm. Off the face, you Tom. You mm. did, you feel me? You did your little thing, but I just want my money like that I gave you. Mm. That's that's, 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 that's solid. That's I mean, that's solid. You can ask for more money. Fi- yeah, you can ask for more money. Right now, you can go through my damn features right now. Five K. Mm. You know, I might show up thirty five hundred, four K, mm. like depending mm. on. Feel me? But I just, I just like I want my money. I paid you. That's mm. right. Like just stuff like that. But they ain't knocking on shout out to Tom. You know, but yeah, for just sure. them kind of situations done mm. came about. But then you got people like. I done paid for videos and features. We do the feature. Now it's time to shoot the video. Boom, we don't never do it. Mm. But then now a whole year later come around and now you want to hit me up. Mm. Oh, let's do this and let's... No, I don't even... Right, 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 I, don't right. even bro, I don't even listen to that song no more. Mm. You feel me? Then you got niggas so. like... Then you got niggas <laughs> like Rollo and Baby who ain't charged me a dime. Yeah. You feel me? Oh, okay, here, young... Damn, what you charge me to... Uh, we done did the song and all this... Oh, just give me like two, three hundred. I'm gonna put you on my Instagram. Shut you out. Ooh. Mm. Then you got niggas like I say, like them who, and I'll charge you a dime for none of that. You know, mm. like I say, you know what's real and what's not. Mm, like true. shout out to all the real ones that's doing it. Like I say, like I really, I really fall them boy heavy. So what's the first? Every time I come to Atlanta, they show love. Like what's the first thing you think if somebody is somebody straight off straight off the streets get into the rap game? What's like the first two, three things you think they need to do or get together to be one, successful? One, they need to get them a product. 
Okay. Feel me? If that's themselves, then then two, they need, once they that's them getting that product, them believing in themselves. You feel me? They jumping in the game, mm-hmm. obviously, you know. And two is like, ain't nobody got you like you got yourself. You need to invest in yourself. Ain't mm-hmm. nobody gonna give you nothing. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Or if they do it, they gonna want something in return. Mm-hmm. Feel me? Like, but you gotta get your own bag, find you a product, get your hustle, run that money up. Like, can't nobody tell you how to spend your money and how to, mm-hmm. you know. Okay, that's, that's what it is. Finally, man, you know, this is 420 week, man. We want to know your craziest <laughs> 420 story. Have you ever had a crazy smoker, smoker's experience? Or has has anybody ever smoked you under the table or smoked you to sleep? Yeah, I ain't going to lie. Well, I ain't watching no movies and all that. You you think like, oh, no, nah, that ain't what's going on there. My first time hitting the bone, I really went to loose now. I thought I was tripping. <laughs> like that, that first time in that bone, different than you. It is. Boy, that, I, that thing potency. hit me so hard and yeah. hit the head. The high uh, potency real quick. Well, like in three minutes. Like it ain't even take long. Yeah. In three minutes, I'm tripping. I, I had to go to sleep. Hey, whole night canceled. Everything. Night I woke canceled. up. It's about six in the morning. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, so that's about my craziest 420. Matter of fact, we was in Tallahassee. At FAM, one mm-hmm. of the little college little. College parties are not college parties. Probably the moon or something. Mm. No, nah, we weren't even in the club. Mm, we was the in their little apartment. Okay, little thing. okay. This, okay. Oh, this was around, bro, this was around like 11. We supposed to be getting ready to go to the club. Yeah. I woke up at 6. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that that brutal. 420. Yeah, 420. Happy 420 Congratulations. to everybody, man. Yes, man. Project Younger, man, we appreciate you pulling up on that Hood Rich Radio. Give everybody your Instagram and introduce yeah. your new single right here. Everything at Project Youngin. You know, they little Project Youngin, man, can't tell me nothing, man. Straight out of St. Petersburg, Florida. Y'all go um, rock with my new single, that shit. New album out now, Project Swift. Shout out DJ Swift. All right, there it is. It's Hood Rich Radio. It's 96.7 The Beat.